In this video, we will continue with the sum of a geometric series. You will find this on page 60 in the Namibia AS level mathematics textbook y equals mx plus c to success. Let's look at another example. Calculate the sum of the geometric series. Okay, they give you the first three and they give you the last term. The problem is you don't know what's that position. So you must first find that position. So first determine the position, the value of m, using the tm formula. So I quickly, I know that a, what is a, is 16. I know that um, to find the value of r, it's going to be half. So, and they tell you it's a, it's a GP, so you can just directly go to the formula. So I substitute, I divide, I use this, I can either use logs to bring that in down, or if I can simplify it, I can do it like this. And I get that this is the 10th term, and then I use the S10, and I just substitute. What was the value of R? The value of R is a half, so it's smaller than 1, so that's why I put the ones in front. But there is my final answer. Okay, I want you to stop the video, and I want you to do try now 21, number B. You can continue the video as soon as you are finished. Let's start. Number B. So this is negative 9 plus 16 minus 4 plus da, 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 plus 1 and 5 over 27. Okay, let's see what do I have. I have A, and what is the value of A? That is going to be negative 9. I know it's a GP, so I can find the value of R. Let's just go. This is term 1. This is term 2. I can find the value of R by saying T2 divide T1. So it's 16 divide negative 9. And if I'm going to simplify that, I'm going to just, just want to see if that is... Oh, it's not 16. It's just 6. Let's see on my answer. There was a mistake. So it's just going to be 6 divide 9. And then I'm going to divide by 3, so it's going to be 2, negative 2 over 3. That's the value of R. Um, I know that Tn is that 1 and 5 over 27. So first use your Tn. So Tn equals A R N minus 1. So it's 1 and 5 over 27 equals negative 9. And the value of R is negative 2 over 3 in minus 1. Okay, so first isolate this by dividing both sides by negative 9. And then simplify this. Now, if you sum, use your calculator and use your ABC. So press 1, ABC, 5, ABC, 27. Divide, and you can make a bracket just because of the negative. Negative 9, close the bracket, equals. Now, I'm getting on my calculator negative 32 over 2, 4, 3. And that's equal to negative 2 over 3, n minus 1. Now, I just want to move this. So, if you do this, so just find your prime factor. So, if you, the prime factors of 32... 2 can go in 16, 2 can go in 8, 2 can go in, um, oh, let me just do it better, uh, I'm not doing it too fast, 2 can go in 16, 2 can go in 8, 2 can go in 4, 2 can go in 2, 2 can go in 1, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so that's going to be 2 to the power of 5, and the same there. So if you say 2, um, two 4, 3, I think it's just working with 3 now. I'm going to show you. So if you say 2, 4, 3, and you start dividing by 3. So 2, 4, 3, divide 3, you get 81. Divide 3, you get 27. Divide 3, you get 9. Divide 3, you get 3. Divide 3, you get 1. So that's 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 to the power of 5. So basically, 
if I say this is going to be negative 2 over 3 to the power of 5 because that is to the power of 5, that is to the power of 5, so I can take 5 out. I'm trying to make the bases the same. Do you see that? And then if I move it up, so therefore 5 is equal to n minus 1 and n is equal to 6. Right, let's just go, and n is equal to 6. So basically, now I'm asking you to find S6. So, let's take another color. S6. Now, what formula, because this, let's just write the formula down. I'm going to use this one. Sn equals A. And the ones is still bigger because it's negative to a third. So, 1 minus R to the power N and 1 minus R. So S6 is equal to A, 1 minus R, okay, let's just start substituting, sorry. So in the place of A, I put negative 9. In the place of 1 minus, and in the place of R, I'm going to put negative 2 thirds. And it's 6, so I put 6, and it's 1 minus, and don't forget to put it in brackets, otherwise you are going to make a mistake. And then basically just press this on the calculator. Multiply, divide, so it's going to be 1 and 2 thirds because that changed to a positive. And my final answer, after I press it on the calculator, will be negative 4 and 25 over 27. And that will be the sum to 6 terms. And that's my final answer.